So I put the Husqvarna head onto this trimmer to replace its actual head for a little while until I get a easy head for the easy echo strain head for this thing. But it's kind of wobbly on there. But I got it on there tight, but it that it will definitely not come off. But I got it on there tight. But they're they're screw nuts are about almost the same. They're about almost the same screw nut. Yeah, I got on there on there really tight. That's far as it can go. It'll it's gonna wobble just just a tiny bit, but it ain't gonna come off. Not a biggie. So now it'll be real easy where I can reload the string into this baby without any trouble. But this is the this is here's the Husqvarna weed whack, weed whacker I was telling you about. As you already seen this one from a previous video, it was about two years ago in spring in March before I went to North Carolina. And uh, it used to last five years or six years, but now it's done. The primer bulb was crack. All I need to do is put, put a new primer, primer bulb in and replace it with a new cable on it. It'll be ready to go. I'll get another another one of these heads for, for this for this weed trimmer, but I'm not sure they still make these heads for these trimmers anymore. If they still make these heads for these fans, let me know in the comments. I would appreciate your answers. I did try it out, but it does it does work very well. It finally works with no trouble. And I'm very happy with this thing. That it took the same stud as this one. I like it. I will continue to use this one for now on. But anyways, there's a new head on the, there's a Husqvarna head on to the PowerSmart trimmer. And there's my old Husqvarna 322L. I think I might be able to get it back up and running, but it's still got plenty of compression into it. At least it might still run, but who knows? There's some extra string for, for it just in case. Now, I'm going to make me something to eat while the weather's cooling off because I'm under the shade because the out, outside is pretty hot. So this evening, I will do another trimming video with this on the GoPro. And we'll see how this baby works on it. We'll see how this baby works. Anyways, I'll catch you on next trimming video. Stay tuned.